welcome back to my channel so today as you guys can tell by the title i do have a valentine's day haul for you guys a lookbook a few outfits of what you guys can wear on that special night out it is february 1st and actually today is february 1st in real time so i am definitely going to do my best which was my goal to get a valentine's day haul out on the first day of the month so that you guys have enough time to run over to the websites order and hopefully get them by the time you guys go out for your special night okay so we're not gonna waste no time because i have several outfits to show you guys so we're not gonna waste any time okay so the brands that i ordered from was ashley stewart red doll and i think that's pretty much it i don't think i did any tour or anything else i think i did ashley stewart and red doll so of course i will link all the information down below and i will also link the name of the items and the pricings okay so i wanted to do a few looks i wanted to do some pants looks i wanted to do um some dresses and i wanted to do a skirt right just for any you know different variety of women who may like to wear pants rather than dresses or um skirts rather than dresses or dresses rather than a skirt or pants whatever type of girl that you are i wanted to kind of dedicate a look to you if that's possible okay so here we have everything full on here from Ashley Stewart. Now I will be doing the accessories and adding the purses and the shoes and the heels and giving you a full look on my Instagram. So make sure you are following me or at Monet's Curvy Closet on Instagram so you guys can see the full look and how I decided to dress up each outfit, okay? Now this, you have a nice pretty lace black top. It does have a nice little bow here. Oh, let me come up okay so it does have a nice little uh tie bow here this is a nice pretty lace top it is a size 26 28 now i thought this was very cute i thought i was going to like stretch it down but actually the style of the of the top is a folded kind of top you know how when you tuck in your pants and then you flare it out well you don't have to do that because it's already like this okay i thought that was really really cute and then I paired it with these cute red orange uh either faux locks or fox leather faux locks that's a hairstyle <laughs> um fox leather or faux leather uh legging pants it does have as you can see the letter the letter <laughs> the leather on the side I thought this was a really cute style very very different from what I normally wear and it does have the leather around the waist it is a size 26 28 as well and i was able to really get into these really really good like they literally fit like a regular legging with leather on the side so i paired it with this um and i'm definitely gonna wear like some really cute black heels and a nice cute clutch purse you guys will see on my website okay well on my instagram <laughs> But um, let me go into the next the next one. I think I'm gonna pair this top with another uh, different bottom. So let's see. Okay, so I kept the top and now we have this pretty uh, red velvet type of skirt here. Now I thought the skirt was a little bit shorter because I was thinking of pairing this with some nice um, tights. I have not worn tights in forever, but it's really, really long. It's actually past my kneecap. So um, I probably am not going to wear any um any tights with these because it just would it, it to me it really wouldn't go i like to wear if i do wear tights again i have not worn them in so long but if i do wear tights i prefer to wear them um with a nice maybe mid-thigh type of skirt or dress um so that most of the uh tights could be shown right but here it since it's very very long i don't think it would go i think it would actually clash um so I'll probably pair this with a nice heel. Now, if you are a skirt girl, you know, where you like to be covered up and you don't really want to wear any pants or you don't want to wear a dress, but you like a nice little skirt. I haven't worn a skirt in years either. <laughs> so, but you know, I just got this in case anyone who does like to wear a skirt um, can and see what it looks like. And so, like I said, I paired it with the black lace top again. You can pair pretty much with anything. I do have a black and white polka dot, um, 
top that I was thinking about kind of pairing it with the red, doing a nice little red lip as you can see here. I mean, just kind of playing with it. You can pretty much play with this dress with a different kind of top. Um, this is a size 26, 28, and I cannot remember the price or whatever, but I probably already put it on the screen. But um, yeah, I thought these had pockets, but it doesn't. And it does have a nice elastic around the waist, so that is good um, for you know our midsection people like me who have a bigger midsection. Um, it is a nice elastic band around the waist. So I'm really digging that, I'm really feeling that. Um, yeah, so let's move right along, girls. I wanna show you everything I got. Okay, so here we have another look here. We have a nice complete pant bottom. Now these pants, first of all, they do not have any buttons or anything like that. So they pretty much just come on um, over or come up uh, like a legging. So I can definitely appreciate that. It does not have any elastic, but it does have some stretch to it. So I had no problems getting this on. And because it is a complete pant, um, it does come a little bit above the knee. I'm sorry, a little bit above the ankle line, but I definitely will pair these if I don't think I have any, but um, I will pair these with the heel with the, the with the heel. Yeah, I will pair these with the shoe with the heel out in the back. That will fit so so cute. Um, because you don't want to do too much. Like if you do like a strap shoe, you don't want to hide the strap by the capri the the pants at the bottom, right? So a nice shoe with the heel out in the back. I don't think I have any though. I don't know, but I me personally, I would do it that way. And then I did pair it with this nice, pretty uh, polka dot top here blouse. It's very, very lightweight, very, very airy. So I don't feel like you would get hot in this. Um, you can absolutely either tuck this in if you want. Um, that look, they look real stank, right? Cause you, I mean, you want to be cute. You want to be sexy. It's about love. It's about, you know what I'm saying? So you don't want to be, you know, you know, you want to be a different, you want to be classy, right? We want to be classy on our date, right? We want to be classy with our men on Valentine's Day, right? <laughs> so, um, but this look is for women who are the business type, who wears pants and blouses every day to their work, um, home. They just have that business-like style. This could be for you. Um, it's still cute. It's still, you know, sexy in a sense of, you know, oh, I can respect that woman. She look like she gonna have a game. You know what I'm saying? So this is for that type of woman. I dig this. I like this. I love how this shirt um, really covers up a lot going on because I don't have a girdle on. So it definitely covers up a lot of uh, the paint, the pants print. You know, you know, you can see your pants print through certain through certain shirts or whatever. But this definitely covers that up. And you can either you know have, let let it hang. Um, if you want as far as opening up the top here, but it don't even look like it's open that much, right? It don't even look like I have that many buttons open. Um, so I like the fact that it really just comes together um, at the top. And it's a, a collar shirt, you know what I'm saying? Polka dot collar shirt. I'm really feeling this around the wrist. It has the polka dot, um, polka dot. Um, why well, I want to call these ankles all the time? <laughs> the polka dot wrist um, style, um, which is cute. And then you can just, you know, pull it down if you want or whatever. That's pretty much up to you, okay? But I'm feeling this. I like this. I'm all for this kind of style. So I think this is cute. Both of these are 26, 28, the pants and the shirt. Um, I like this, this is so cute. And with the red lip, like I love to pair a red lip with black white or polka dot so i'm absolutely wearing a red lip and i actually have a red clip listen y'all gotta stay tuned because i'm definitely having a shoe um an accessory haul so it's gonna be some shoes it's gonna be um purses and jewelry and i definitely have a red clutch that will go with this or crossbody but since we went real classy we're gonna do a crop a, a clutch with this okay <laughs> but let me go ahead to the next outfit okay all right, so here we have another outfit. I actually wanted to pair this with another pants, but um, a different pair of pants, but it didn't fit. And I will show you what those pants were, but I do want to show you guys this top. Actually, this top was a piece, a second piece to a skirt bottom. That's exactly this material and stuff. But okay, am I the only one? And I think I said this before, but am I the only one that sometimes you order something and you think you're ordering a whole set? and you actually order the top or just the bottom. And so this will happen with that, okay? Or that's what happened with this. <laughs> I cannot talk, it's too early. But 
I thought I was ordering both the set because it's a top and it's a skirt bottom. And I looked at my order and I'm like, um, where's the bottom at? And I looked at my receipt or in my, in my email receipt and I just ordered the top. So I'm like, what am I going to do? I try to go back online to see if the skirt, um, is available. It wasn't, I will try to find a picture of what it's supposed to look like. Um, but I'm like, you know what? I can still find something to do with the top. So I paired it with the capri pants. You can pair it with, you know, whatever you want. Um, but I did pair it with the capri pant. It is an off the shoulder, um, blouse. I like the fact that it's very, very droopy, um, in the arm and the wrist area. So I really do. My God, my boobs look. Hey girl, oh, you look good. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but I do like the fact that it does droop over the arms. I mean, over the hands. I do like that style or whatever. I don't know what it is. It just, I like it. Okay. And it is a drawstring in the middle. So you can pull this even tighter if you want. I don't want to, because I don't, I like this length. I don't want it to be all the way under here. Like, I don't want that girl. Your boobs are beautiful. Anyway. Um, and so here is the back of it here. You guys can see the tag. Oh, this is from rub doll. Um, so as you guys can see the tag, and you can see my booty. Um, <laughs> but like I said, I did pair it with uh, the capri pant, which I think is actually cute. Now, I did say you want to be classy, right? But I think this is still, like, real cute. This is sexy classy, right? It's not showing... Okay, I take the back. It is showing a lot. It's showing a lot up here. Okay, if you that girl, listen, this outfit is for you then, okay? If you that girl like to show a little something, something, not too much, but show a little something, something, okay? You want to show a little midriff or whatever, do you, boo-boo, this outfit may be for you. And again, like I said, I will pair this with the heel, with the a shoe, with the heel out um, in the back. I just think that is so cute. So, boom, here you have it. This is Rub Doll. This is Ashley Stewart, I want to say, size 26 to 28. Um, or 4X, same difference, and of course, 26, 28, um, 4X. All right, so we have two dresses. Oh, I wanted to show you guys those pants. Hold on. Okay, so here are the pants. These pants are from Ashley Stewart. They remind me so much of like cowboy chaps. I think that's what they call them, um, where they have the fringes on the side, you see? And these are leather, and they have the little fringes. And this is a size 26, 28, but they didn't come over my butt. So I really, I couldn't even button it up at all. My butt was just, was not having it. But I thought these were really cute. I thought these were really different. Um, I would have probably paired it with this top, or that's cute. Oh, a nice leather skirt. I think I've seen some leather skirts. Listen, y'all need to get on Ashley Stewart. Ashley Stewart got some really cute clothes. I think they did have like a high waist leather skirt. Okay, anyway, I need to go back on there. But um, I was going to pair this either with a black uh, lace top that I showed you guys earlier or pair it with the polka dot, um, the polka dot uh, blouse. And I was just going to just tuck it in or whatever. Um, but yeah, so I really wish these would have fit, but they don't. So here here they are all right so you know your girl got some dresses okay and this dress baby is so cute okay so this dress is from rev doll this is a size 4x 26 28 honey every girl needs a black dress in her closet okay every girl needs a black dress and i think i got three or four um black dresses in my closet this honey first of all this dress fits me so good like a glove. I don't have a girdle on. I probably will wear a girdle with this. But the fact that my body is booming and busting through this, look at my booty, okay? And it's a nice, great length. As you can see, it does have a drawstring right here. So you can either loosen this up if you want, or you can keep it at this length if you want to give you that nice little cute split. Look at this. Girl, you, <laughs> listen. I ain't got no Valentine's Day, but that's okay. Because I'm just going to love myself, all right? And you should too if you're single, okay? But this is beautiful. It has a nice open neck, so you can definitely wear a nice jewelry piece with this. It is so comfortable. It is so stretched. has so much stretch to it. There's pretty much nothing else I can say. You can clearly see. Okay, you can clearly see what a nice pump. Now, the one thing I like about black is you can wear pretty much anything accessory rise with black. So I'll probably do either a nude or probably just do a um, a black heel. But I do have some rainbow bedazzle heel. 
just check out my Instagram because you're going to see how your girl about to do this up, okay? But let me go on to the next dress. That's all I got to say. It ain't too much. You see it. You already see it. Let's go on to the next and last dress. Okay, so you know your girl had to end with the signature color of red for Valentine's Day, okay? Now, this dress is also from Rev Doll. I want to say this is a size 4X, but I feel like it's actually a size 5X because this is a little bit big for me. And I think the reason why I ordered it big because I felt like the material was going to be a little tight. So if I ordered it a bigger size, then it'll fit just right. But this material is actually very, very stretchy. Like I thought it was going to be one of those really fit bodycon fitting type of dresses. So I wanted to make sure I look good in it. But this is actually a little bit too big. But I like the style and I like the look that they were going for. It's a red polka dot dress here with your see-through blouse. It got the whole hoo, 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 hoo. But you see, it's, it is really big. Like you see all this excess here and it's it's really, really big. So I definitely will probably order the correct size next time um, if I was to get this dress or whatever. But this is really cute. Of course, I think I already put the price and everything on the screen already. But hey, this is pretty much it, okay? I hope you guys like and appreciate this haul. Let me know if you want to do more, if you want me to do more lookbooks like this. But I hope you guys appreciate this Valentine's Day haul. I hope you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day. And if you are, look at this. If you are single, that is totally fine. Valentine's Day is about love. It doesn't necessarily have to be about you being with somebody, but just loving yourself, loving your family, loving who you're with, and just spread love as well, okay? I hope you guys appreciate this haul. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. I appreciate you guys. Follow me on my social media, and um, yeah.